What do you know about digital citizenship and safety? What should students know about communication online and netiquette? In this classroom conversation, a teacher talks to students about privacy and online communication. So your first photography projects are due next week. Does anyone have any questions? Yes, we can photograph whatever we want to, right? That's correct. But make sure you protect your private information. For example, if you are taking a photograph of your car, don't show your license plate number. That makes sense. Thanks for the tip. You're welcome. And once you finish your photograph, I would like you to post it on our discussion board online. Then you can type comments on your classmates' photographs. Are there any questions about this? Yes, I have one more question. Should we write suggestions for how our classmates can improve their photographs? Yes, I want you to comment on what you like about their photographs, but also make suggestions. But make sure you're polite. It's important to be kind online, just like we are in class. To help your students stay safe online, you can provide them with proactive knowledge about digital citizenship. When speaking with students about online privacy and communication, you can consider these questions. Do students know how to protect private details, like their address? Do students know that private details can appear in photographs? Do students know about netiquette or etiquette rules for communicating online? What do you think students should know about communicating online? This is American English. Thank you for watching.